people are looking at you or people are watching and they're watching from their own point of view mm. and they could have the craziest idea or make up the craziest stories about who they think you are sure. so you come to the house and you have all these things that people have actually made you out to be and um as nice as it is to like have all the fame and uh, be on the spotlight coming out of the reality tv show especially it's like you've been silenced for three months sure and everyone else has something to, to say they have their own narrative and they're writing their own stories yeah. so when i shy affairs here welcome to another great video this time around kosi is coming your way with her vlog yes so Ketsi Big Brother in Zamzi. She announced this on Sunday when they premiered the in Zamzi season four, where she announced with this post that you know her fans should check her YouTube channel that she's bringing in the tea. We all remember when she was in Big Brother Titans. There was a sh there was this you know session. She used to interview her colleagues in the show where she called it uh coffee with cozy yes so that is the same thing that is premiering on her youtube channel where she's going to be talking about big brother and zamzi reality show basically like a vlog uh like a podcast but this time around if in case for example when they interview when they evict evict um housemates this season that's in zamzi when they evict housemates season uh when they edit housemates in the season, you know, they are going to be interviewed by Kosi, Ketsi, Big Brother. So basically, it's like the way they do it on uh, Big Brother Niger also, where when you get evicted, <clears throat> you'll be interviewed by, uh, is it Miss? There's a lady you'll be interviewed by and Toke as well. So that's something similar that they are portraying on this uh, so about this time around is with Kosi's uh program. So congrats to her, huge one right there. She was really celebrating it. Happy for her. I mean, if you're a fan, this is this is a very nice way to collaborate with the show. Very, very, very cool one right there. As oh well, this this is this is how improved she, she has been. And of course, that's to also say, you know, the franchise is happy with her, or should I say South Africa, Big Brother. Uh, franchise is happy with her, you know, they find pretty much <laughs> Love is loving, guys. This love is loving. Yes, so on the low and on the loud. the least so yes guys uh that is uh blue eva right there uh to then hear me as usual so again their relationship friendship they've not come out to declare it publicly but of course the way they are moving is screaming people who are in a ship not just a ship but you know in a kind of really romantic relationship so yes uh over the weekend that was what happened with yemi and blue eva thank you guys so much uh for watching i'll see you all in the next video blue eva i'm like there's like a couple thingy <laughs> you know <laughs> all right now talking about your you know big brother titan mm -hmm. how is the relationship with former housemate it's great you know people have been cool with inside the house we still cool even now okay. you know, it's been it's been amazing even yemi you know? <laughs> so what you did there? <laughs> How, how's that going? Has the ship sailed? Is it crashing? Is it gonna is it gonna sail? <laughs> you know, okay, okay, my lips crossed right. She's she's crossing her lips right now. Alright, how about Kosi though? Do, do you guys talk? 
Um, can we talk about Budwai? Can we talk about? <laughs> you give this thing? Oh, no. <laughs> of course we will. Of course, I'm not gonna put you in the hot seat there. Nah, I mean, it's not even a hot seat. Hey, like I'm cool with everybody, yeah, man. Yeah. I'm I'm honestly cool with everybody. You know. People <laughs> loving blue eyes. I'm like, there's like a lot of couple thingy. <laughs> you know. <laughs> All right, now talking about your, you know, Big Brother Titans. I understood that you know what I have so much work to do mm. to er erase all these things that I've been called or labeled or uh, seemed as you know yeah. what I mean because sometimes you know what I've noticed about people Nam, tell us <laughs> <laughs> when they feel that you're not deserving or maybe they feel like they are deserving or they think somebody else is deserving of the grace yeah then they start finding fault of why you shouldn't be in that place so it's the same thing because like okay no but like she's not pretty enough ah. oh she's not smart enough you know ah. and it, it's just all those things and that's when like the name calling and all the misconceptions about who you are really starts yes. so you can't take that too personal really you must tell them to shut up because they don't have a million now exactly <laughs> thank yeah, you very much I mean, <laughs> about reality tv i don't understand it's like you you have to understand that you people are looking at you or people are watching and they're watching from their own point of view mm. and they could have the craziest idea or make up the craziest stories about who they think you are sure. so you